new netbook has arrived today. It's the HP Mini 110 netbook, which is HP's new 10 inch, latest 10 inch netbook. This one comes with a 1366 by 768 HD display and it has, it's, it's the what model with Windows 7 Starter, so it has an upgraded 250GB hard drive, Atom N280 processor, 1GB of RAM, so there we go. First let's just take a look what else is in the box here. Okay, oh, it looks like I've got a 3 cell battery, I didn't know about that. I wanted a 6 cell battery. Okay, there's the, the power brick and a cable and a, another adapter. What else we have? Got a microfiber wipe here. And we've got an assortment of manuals. Is there a, a recovery DVD in here of some sort? Uh, okay, so no recovery DVD. Looks like you have to make your own. So that's all there is in the box. Let's take a look at the HP Mini 1 pin itself. So, kind of disappointed that I've got only the 3 cell battery. But at least it won't stick out. Okay, so there we go. It's got a nice kind of pattern on the lid there. Okay, so I like that keyboard. Let me just put in the battery. Any kind of SIM slot. Okay, so we've got a SIM slot right in the corner here. And looks like you can fit it right in already. And there is another slot here, I don't know what that is for. Okay, anyway, let's just put in the battery. Three cell battery, I hate three cell batteries. Not enough battery life. Okay. Oh, at least it's flush. That's great. Okay, as I said, it has. Ouch. As I said, it has a high resolution uh, 1366 by 768 display, which makes it pretty unique for a netbook. Not many have that uh, high resolution, resolution display. Have a look at the keyboard here, very wide keyboard, lots of keys, big keys. Not a fan of this kind of style of touchpad here with the mouse buttons on the side, but you get used to it. So let's have a closer look there. And it's a matte display. First, let's just take a look around. Uh, what do we have on the sides here? We've got uh, on the left hand side, a Kensington lock, got the uh, power there, one USB, and a shared headphone and microphone jack here. On the other side, two more USBs at the front, VGA, and the LAN port at the back here. And the flush six cell, uh, sorry, three cell battery. And uh, on the front, what do we have here? We've Got uh, the Wi Fi switch here, and we've got the power switch here. On the bottom, we have got one slot for RAM. So it looks like there's no access, no easy access to the, uh, the PCI Express slot because I wanted to test out the Crystal, the Broadcom Crystal HD player. And let's turn it on. Okay, 
Okay, so a matte high resolution display makes this HP Mini 110 a pretty unique out of all the netbooks on the market right now. And let's just compare that to my Samsung N140. Okay, as you can see here, they're pretty much pretty similar in size. The Samsung N140 has a 6 cell battery which kind of sticks out a tiny bit but it's uh, basically it's hidden tucked underneath so you don't see it out jutting out at the back like on the Acer HB or Dell netbooks it only raises the height a tiny bit okay so let's just Turn this on as well. So they've both got wide keyboards and matte displays. Well, we don't need that anymore. Okay, let's just uh, zoom in. Okay, the touchpad feels a little weird. Okay, I really like that display. I have owned a 1366 by 768 display on a netbook before on the EPC 1005HR, and I've come to like the display over the uh, 1024 by 600 display because got more flexibility, more resolution, I just find it better now. So that is the HB Mini 110, perhaps I can go over the specs once more. Uh, one gigabyte of RAM, 250 gigabyte hard drive, 0 0.3 megapixel webcam, and it's got BG Wi-Fi, Windows 7 starter, a matte 10.1 inch 1366 by 768 display. And the specs. Atom N280 processor, 5 in 1 card reader, and uh, Bluetooth. And mine has a 2 cell battery. The 6 cell battery should stick out at the back and raise the height of the netbook. So let's take a look, another look at that display. Very nice matte display. Love that display. Not sure. Again, the, like the three cell battery, the two hours for a netbook, two hours of battery life for a netbook is not that great, which I'm expecting. Or at least under three hours for this three cell battery. So. Anyway, that is the HP Mini 110. Stay tuned for more updates on this later. So, thanks for watching. Pete here from Airport.